Hi, good evening. Well, it was the perfect day for baseball, and tonight was the start of district play for 35A. The talk around town, everyone is calling 35A Little Big 12. Now, here's what's going on tonight. Veterans Memorial taking on Carroll at Cabinus. Moody will be at Waterburger. Actually, they're at Waterburger Field right now. Taking on Flower Bluff, Cal Allen was at Toloso Midway. That was at 7 p.m. Ray was in Alice, and Gregory Portland kicked it all off tonight at Waterburger Field as they took on Miller. Now, we talked to GP on how they felt about starting off district play and what to look forward to for this season. Man, just to start off district at this field, you know, where these former Astros players have played, you know, them just coming off winning the World Series, like, it's amazing. Like, you feel a different energy for sure. It's just an exciting time for everybody in South Texas to get 11:35 a started off. Uh, everybody's been waiting on this, and it's just exciting to be one of the first games to kick off. Now the Wildcats were taking on the Miller Bucks. That game started at 5, and this is what we have from tonight's game. Now Wildcats are visitors, so they were first at bat. Still top of the first, and Wildcats already up 2-0 with one out. That's junior Trey Acosta at bat. He hits a dagger, and Alex Aguirre will get a close run for the Wildcats. Aguirre is safe, and Cats are now up 3-zip. Now junior baseman Nick Catalano at bat here. A nice hit to center, and he's off to the races to really get that game going. He made it around the bend first then second, and he made it all the way over to third. He also got an RBI there. Now bringing the Wildcats up, five zip in the top of the first. That final, Gregory Portland killed it, winning this game 18 zip over the Miller Bucks. Now GP play Alice this Friday, and Tolosa.